I always end up as a second play dish in your life. Blackmailing me again? Don't you understand that what we've got is just a family agreement, Carla? Do you want some? Get off me, you filthy. Can you see you're interrupting a very important discussion? Stop! Now you'll see how it rape your... Don't you worry. We are leaving. On top of being bitter stingy, you didn't buy me a bracelet! Oh, these damn rich people only passing the time in here. Marianne, what are you doing? Did your stuff fall? No, don't you know I just love to sell them things here on the floor? Well, of course they fell, aren't you watching? Yeah, well, not even my mom's scolding. You know I'm from the streets. I don't like that thing about it. school and education and such. I love to work for me, getting my money for the day and buying my own food. Please, let me work with you. We can live both in the streets. And if you want, I can bring a blanket from home. No, Juan Daniel. I already told you I like to be alone and work for myself. You know my mom only lives with my dad and they don't even watch us. But you know what? I will work and work so I can get a little house and then you can come live with me. But until then, you have to go home. Please, let me work with you. No, Juan Daniel, and you better get home now. Hey, don't leave me talking alone. How much longer are we gonna keep fighting? I'm tired, Carla! I don't care, Isaias. You gave my parents your word that you'll marry me. Now you have to stand to it. Why should I have to keep a promise I don't like? I never even liked you. You're the most annoying woman I know. What? You don't like me? Please. Thousands of men will give you anything to be with me. I don't think you're a fool. Plus, we're from the best families of this place. We belong together. No, 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 no! You're a cold, desperate woman. You're completely shallow. My father will hear about all of this. You are a lizard man. Coward. You will pay for all of this. You're insane! <coughs> Bracelets. Would you like to buy one? You're such a pretty girl. Beautiful. But not right now. Thank you. Come on, please. I haven't sold any today and I want to eat. They're so pretty. Do you make them? Yes, I do make them all. Oh, they have really pretty colors. They are pearls. Mm, well, what can I say? Wouldn't you like to work for me? The girl who helped us went out of town and we need someone to help me. Do you want to come work at my house? Really? Yes, really. Do you accept? Yes, yes, I accept. That's great. What's your name? Marianne. Marianne what? Just Marianne, that's it. No last name? Yes, no last name. And you? Ines. <laughs> nice to meet you, Miss Ines. So, can we go now? But what's for dinner today? <laughs> You're a very funny girl. I like you already. have a pretty and luxurious house. I just had something, eh? If something breaks, it was not my fault. Huh? Ah, does that guy come in the package, miss? You! What are you doing here? Where did your bitter girlfriend go, huh? Who are you? I've never seen you. <laughs> now you don't know me, Blondie. You are the ones who threw all my stuff the other day. And you know what, missus? He treated me very bad. Is that true, Isaias? <sighs> of course not, mom. So you're the son of Miss Ines. Let me tell you one thing, you were very lucky. With that son, you don't want enemies. Respect me, please. You're in my house. No, my son. This is my house. I decided to hire Marianne to help me with the chores in this house. What? Why did you hire this beggar? 
taken her in what not. This is where I will live. Missy Ness already told me that it's her house, isn't it? Of course it is. And as a gentleman I've raised, introduce yourself to Marianne, because she is the girl that will help us here in the house. Nice to meet you, Marianne. My name is Isaias. Nice to meet you too, Isaias. Even if you act like you don't know me. What do you mean? I'm not used to talking to people like you. Look, miss, look. I'm only telling you that if he keeps talking to me like that, I will beat him up. Come on, kids. Stop fighting. Come here, Marianne, so you get to your room, take a bath, change clothes, and get very pretty. What do you think now? I have my own bedroom too. See you later. She's Mariana. Oh, damn. Since when making it just got so complicated. And these machines don't help a thing. Hey! Hey, 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 get, get off me. I didn't give you permission to hug me, so get away from me. I'm just coming to help you because it looks like you don't know how to use any of this. Well, nobody asked you anyway, so get away, please. Come on, why are you always so grumpy and rebel? Well, yes, and get away now or Miss Ness is going to scold me. Okay, then. Here's your juice. What is this? It looks horrible. Mm, first drink it and then you can judge. <laughs> what is wrong with you? What did you spit me? Does it taste so bad? Bad? It's disgusting. Here, try it. <gasps> I'm not acting against you only because Miss Ines will fire me. But she will know about this blondie. <laughs> Mrs. Mrs. Your son just threw the juice at me and ruined the clothes you gifted me. Maybe she's not here. But maybe I can wear something from here, huh? This is way too large. They're giving me all of this. Uh, not this one. What is this? This lady has some weird taste. Oh! <laughs> this one. This one is right. Well then. There's nothing else I can wear those, they don't fit me. Now don't even show up blondie because you'll get in trouble. I told you to get away from me. You're looking fine, but where did you get that dress from? From your mom's wardrobe or was it yours? My mom doesn't wear those. But you look good in it. Look, Blondie, you better get away. I told you many times already. The further, the better. You got some really pretty eyes. Your mom is going to school me. She could think we're doing things that are not. Nothing's gonna happen. So that's why you decided to break up with me. You're the one I wanted to see. I knew that someday I was going to find you. Come here! <laughs> You're such an animal. Isaias, who is this nobody and why is she wearing my dress? <laughs> Surely you don't know who I am, but you did throw all my stuff down in the shore, huh? <laughs> there is no doubt. You can put lipstick on a pig. And still a pig. Why don't you go and leave me alone to talk to Isaias, please? Oh, girl, it's so obvious that you know nothing. The one that lives here, it's only me and myself. What do you mean by that? Isaias, how did you allow that? That's right, Carla. Marianne now lives in this house. Miss Ines, with all due respect, 
she is not worthy of living in this house. Oh, I'm so tired of hearing about you, the rich versus us, the poor. I better get going. It's great that the stink is now gone because... In the politest way I know, I'm asking you to leave the house and tell your parents that your but engagement yes. to Isaias is now broken. I am not allowing you to marry my son. You're a person with no values or education that walks around mistreating people. Isaias! Isaias! Marian! Marian, wait! What do you want now? Are you going to tell me that I'm a stinky, a beggar? Aren't you tired? No, 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 no. I just came to apologize. The truth is you don't deserve to be treated that way. What happened is that I had a moment and that's it, but I ain't bad nor someone disrespectful. I knew that behind those eyes there was a nice person. But look, Blondie, I'm... I'm not from here. I prefer the streets. Besides, I'm not what you're looking for in here. Wait, wait. Please, don't leave. Since you arrived, I started smiling. And I started to feel things that were very far gone. And look, I don't know what will happen. But don't leave. Is a yes. I just can't believe that this is happening. I gave you everything, my love, time, and you'd rather change me for this lack. You see, you deserve this. What is wrong with you? Oh, you damn slack. Time for a bad little girl. Did you think I was gonna bear you? Stop, Marianne. So... Will you come back home now? Well, I guess... Isaias! Isaias! Come back to me! Isaias! Wouldn't you rather some juice? Nothing for me? I don't know if you like it. I like everything from you. Oh, come on, Blondie.